Hi and welcome to the Alex Vlog. So yesterday thousands of Year 9 students across New Zealand finished their first year of high school. Congratulations! And then packed their bags and went home for the holidays. And that's the easy bit done. Now the tricky bit is to go back in 2017 and not make the same mistakes that a lot of people do when they go into Year 10. Because a lot of people think that Year 10 is the most unimportant year of your school life. But that couldn't be any further from the truth, because if it wasn't important, then the government wouldn't make you do it. A lot of people go into Year 10 with a false impression that it's just a year... It's basically, that they just treat it like it's Year 9 Part 2. Like a sort of certain extension of the skill set that they don't really need, and they think, oh, well, oh, I don't really need to focus this year, year, because what I do doesn't really count to anything, and it's like, and, and, like, and they think that, well, I'm not new to the school anymore, so I don't need to set a good impression for my teachers anymore, because I'm, because I've been here for a year already, and a lot of people just generally think that it's a year that doesn't really matter very much, but actually it does, does, for two main reasons. One, is set up for NCA and two is working habits. It's so NCA. NCA um, for people overseas stands for National Certificate of Educational Achievement. It is basically basically your qualification of life. It is the it is three years years of of studying and coursework and most importantly exams that prove though that you that gives you a certificate that proves though that you are an educated person pretty much. When you're in year 10 you think you you look at NCA in the future and you think well that's well that's all great I'll worry about that when I come to it and and then you think I don't have to worry about this year yeah and I mean and I mean yes I mean no employer is ever going to bring up your year 10 results to see how how clever you were back then but those results alts that you get in year 10 are important for something and that is setting you up for your year 11, 11 and then your year 11 will set you up for year 12 and your year 12 sets you up for year 13 and, and that's important because how well you do in year 10 will ultimately dictate the classes that you get put into in, uh, in year 11 whether you go into streamed 111 classes, whether you're in mainstream 101, whether you're in 102 or 103 or whatever Tether. it will help set that up and it will also and also if you get build up yourself a good skill base in in year 10 then that's a perfect lead up for going into year 11 because I know from experience that going from year 10 to year 11 isn't actually that big of a step up part in what's required of you it's actually a much bigger step up going from year 11 to year 12 than it is going from year 10 to year 11 and that's and that's actually true and 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 believe and believe me a lot of I know a lot of teachers that will tell you exactly that then you've got the other side of it which is working habits now if you've already got several bad working habits by the time that you reach year 10 then then we've already got a problem but if you haven't now is definitely not a good time to start because if you've been a brilliant student right up till now and you and you come across and you somehow fall upon this mindset that year 10 is not important and you start screwing around then that's going to start getting into you and you're going to and 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 as much as you say to yourself I'm only going to I'm only going to worry about it this year I'll focus in year 11 and then and I've known several people who've been like that they've mucked about they've mucked about in year 10 then they've got to year 11 and then they said right this year's NCA this year I'm actually going to focus and they just can't manage it because they've already got that behaviour firmly locked into their head and they can't get out of those habits. It's, that's why it's important that in year 10 you get yourself into those good working habits before you reach NCEA and then you're, and then you're really on the road to success and that is fundamental.